Chick, chick, chilly dog. Hey guys, David Clear Knight here, and we're back for the NR2004. Scratch that. NR2003 Shop Art Series season. The 2004 season, the Brickyard 400 is here. Asher Byron leads by just 99, and this is gonna get. This is gonna be a crazy race, a crucial race at that. Um, as you see here, by the way, Derek Drew is 49th in the standings. He has one start right now. He drove in the 88 in the Daytona 500. He got like, he only said, I don't know what spot it was, but I'll find out eventually. He's coming back. He's doing a few races this year. Uh, he's going to try to defend his victory. He won here last year. He wants to defend it Driver, as he is there. And that's 78. Car. You'll see his car. He's sponsored by Kroger right now. Um, Jim Sales, DNQ'd. Dario Sanchez. Hermie Sadler's in here. What the heck, dude? So you'll see. Let's see how he is in qualifying. He's looking to defend his victory. He qualifying second. Holy shoot. There he is. There he is, my dude. Can he hold it? Last place goes to a reveler. Defending that victory. He's coming in for a Driver. few races this year. Only a few. Oh, no. Not again. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I don't know what Pep was doing there, but. Drivers. All right, here we go. Derek Drew has had a cringy career. No, has had a weird career. He's coming to make a few. He got signed finally. He's making a few starts this year to prepare for a rookie coming in to drive this exact car next year. Flint Byron will be driving this car next year for 2005. He's contending for a Whole Foods Series championship right now. Um, so he's preparing to see how this car drives and it's R&B for his teammates and brothers. Pep Drew in the 88 and Eric Drew in the 97, who's... Toward the back, actually. Aaron Abel's on pole. Can that 78 stay alive for more than one lap? This was this his third start he made last year. Last year, this was the race that he made his third career start. And he won. Let's see if he can make it two in a row. And become the first driver to sweep a to win a particular race two years in a row. Green flag is gonna be out for Aaron Abel. It's on hundred and eight percent, so maybe yet no one will die. As Derek Drew's on the outside, stuck. He's going to get past, but let's see if he's just playing a good strategy to not die. I got to keep this camera. I don't want to see if everyone just dies. Oh. oh, we got cars around. There they go. Caution's out. Jerry Smith around again. We got cars all in the back. The Abel's all with damage. Derek's running third. He survived. He survived. Oh, wait. This corner. Oh, crap. I forgot about this corner. Aaron's gonna stay up in the wall, around they go! Wreck racing the line, Derek's around! Oh my goodness! Oh crap. Guys, oh my gosh. This is bad. This is some serious stuff. Oh my gosh, what just happened? What the heck just happened? Jerry Drive won back. Hold on. I just love how I see Smith in the background already dying. Alright. Rutherford gets into Meteor. He gets into Smith. Drew, Eric Drew was able to avoid that, which is good for him, but he probably died in the wreck after. What the heck happened here? Everyone just gets held up here, looks like. Oh, huge hit there. Yeah, everyone was really just getting spun out there. And I don't know what just happened here. All right, Aaron Abel. Hooey! All right, this is taking a little long. Sound I'm looking for. 111. I had it on one. All right, let's see. Into the wall in front of everybody. And looks like Drew had a good idea on the outside, but Cameron Regal is going so fast, just rams that 78 and blocks every lane. And then Howard and, oh my, what in the actual heck happened? Aiden Johnson, everyone is getting involved. Oh my goodness. And that 29 just 
I don't know what he was doing there, but I think that 29 got drilled afterwards. Let's see. Yep, by Hermie. Right there. Bong. Huge hit there. I don't know what they're doing. Everyone. Look, these guys. Smith is doing his best to go to a complete stop. Who is alive? Who? I repeat. Looks like Derek Drew retires with a radiator, so his long away to return last one could one lap. One. After one lap, 13 cars remain. 13. Of course, Asher Byron doesn't wreck out. He's going to extend his points lead by at least 3 million points, as, of course, Eric Drew didn't make it, so he's dead somewhere. 34. So there's the championship. Asher Byron's going to win back to back again, of course. Oh my gosh, why? Green flag is out. Yippee. Harris Wales is about to die. There he goes, Kelvin. Bye, Kelvin. How are all the Carson Motorsports cars still alive? What luck is that? All right, I don't trust anyone right now. Byron's going for the lead now. I don't trust anything. I don't trust anyone. Here's why. Crash. Crash. Oh, and Turner, of how did you manage to still get flipped, dude? Again, two races in a row, seriously? As caution comes out, Donald Wilson, Harris Wales wins back at the line. Yippee, more dead cars. I don't even care about the pit sequence. I wanted this race to be over with. Donald Wilson is leading. And one oh, oh my gosh, the caution. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? All right, this is what ended up happening. They just ended up wrecking somehow, so we're not going to ask how that happened, Carson and Drive, but RIP. Looks like, oh my gosh, they're going to kill each other. They're going to kill each other. The teammates will kill each other racing back to the line. They will. Oh my gosh, dude, you guys are aggravating me. Wilson wins back at the line. Yay. Oh my gosh, there's six cars left. Six. Big, yeah. Oh my gosh, dude. Six. This is worse than last year. Green flag's already out. No one has died. Bronze is just chilling in the pit road, waiting for everyone to die so he can get his second win. <laughs> oh my gosh. Don't do this. Don't do this to me, dude. Don't actually do this. They're dead. How are these guys left? Of course Byron's left. He's always around. We got cars already just, just going to dive to pit road. Donald Wilson is just going to leave with Sergi Thompson. Oh my god. We're already halfway through. Dude, this is not a fluke. This is the actual race. What? It's happening. Oh, Rutherford just left. Well, now we have five cards left. Four actually racing because Bronze is just sitting there. Oh my gosh. Thompson goes for the lead, so at least we have something going on. Um... He just breezed by Wilson there. I watched the 21 now slide up and kill himself. Is they're both dead. Dude, I, if everyone did. What is Reveler doing? What the heck is the one car doing? Dude. Oh, and not. Oh my freaking gosh, dude. Iron's about to win. Iron is about to win. These guys are about to leave the race. Wilson keeps going. Okay, what the heck? Where's Thompson? Where did you even qualify, my man? Oh my gosh, this race. I'm removing this track for the 2005 schedule. I have to. Looks like we have Byron and Revler contending for victories. Well, Byron's not a surprise. I don't know why Bronze is just sitting here. I don't know what they're doing. He's probably just waiting so he can just take the most spots he can. And Byron just got rid of all the fixing that they did to the right side of his car as Wilson comes out. So at least he's alive. Thompson's still considered the leader, but I don't know what they're doing. Looks like Wilson will... Looks like Byron's going to be leading. And there goes Thompson, hopefully. Yep, there he goes. Bye. Byron to the lead. 
Revler actually is competing with him. Logan Revler, I don't care if this is your first win, bro. What the? Oh my gosh, dude. What was that? You expect me to know what that was. Dude, this is why you got to go back down to Whole Foods full time next year. Competing for championship right now. You don't need to be doing this. You're wasting your time. You can come back. Not now. Wow, Byron. Oh, and Reveler getting all that time back. Ooh, this just got good. See what these guys are going to do. This is a crash fest. It's just a demo derby. Who can last the longest? Because bronze doesn't count. I don't know what he's doing. Byron gets bonus points. Yay. He just got the fastest lap as well, which is amazing. And we they lead. Oh gosh, Wilson, why? We don't need to witness another wreck. This won't even be a caution if they wreck. Alright, good. Let's see, can Byron get his third win of the season and just dominate the rest of the year to win the second championship? Excuse me. In the wall. Byron and Reveler kept going. Speed difference, though. Oh, and there goes Thompson. That's not a caution, though, because no one's near him. Thompson's around. No caution for that, though. Rip to the 21. Can Reveler catch back up to that six guard? It's looking a little... No, the one just keeps smacking the wall. I don't think they loosen the wedge enough. All going to come down to turn three. Turn three because that's the death corner. We have four. Four cars racing and one's just lying in the pit. Oh my gosh. I'm just ha I just want to see if anyone will hit the right rear of their car on that wall to spin out. I'm just waiting to see the perfect moment. Revler is gaining on that six car. He just has the fast slap. How in the world did he do that? Let's see if Thompson. Does Thompson spin out again? Nope. Barely makes, missed it. Here comes Logan Revler to take the lead eventually. Can he get around that six car? Oh, the six at the wall. There goes Revler to the bottom. Can this race end? Can this race just end? I hate this race. Iron hits the wall. Reveler keeps going. Reveler to the... I, dude, what is happening? What is happening? Oh, what? And Byron's just heading into the pits. That's amazing. This is one of the most entertaining races I've ever seen. Oh, Thompson, I thought he was going to spin out. Did Byron just quit? Oh, I thought he didn't. He did. All right, let's see. This, the six car decided to quit. I don't know why Kelvin Bronze is still there, but he's just there. Byron is going to fix the car. And change tires. I don't see why you should change tires. This is the one of the most boring races I've ever seen. It had one of the most memorable crashes, but it was terrible. Whole Foods is looking pretty interesting right now. <laughs> Reveler comes in. Wilson is dying. Oh my gosh. Why are these cars the only ones left? There's Wilson. He takes back the lead. Before Reveler got even to lead two laps. Donald Wilson's... Dude, I just want to skip the rest of the race. It is so unbelievably terrible. Oh my gosh, Byron is a lap car. Reveler qualified last, dude. What? So did he just... He had the... How did Thompson just steal it? That lap time, 49, is probably terrible compared to the record right now. Wait, that's actually... How is that almost the NASCAR record? He's two tenths off the NASCAR record. What in the actual frick? Reveler's out. Yay! All three, all four of them are back. Let's see if Wilson can survive. Actually, he already did. He's ahead of Thompson by 
11 seconds. Hey, they just lap Reveler. Like, dude. I am this close to clicking the skip button, dude. I love how these guys got all got top 10s, even though they're dead. I love how Rutherford's going to get a top 5, even though he's dead, because Kelvin Bronze isn't doing anything other than sit on pit road. Sucks for Derek Drew and his return. Looks like two in a row won't be happening, but he hopefully those other races that he'll be dry, racing will be good. As, ooh, we got an actual competitive fight going on. Reveler just letting Byron go to the outside for the outbrink of death. This is the worst thing I've... Oh, crap. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Oh, he wanted him. He wanted him to wreck with him. He wanted that. I saw that. Dude, this is so weird. An 11 and a half second lead for Donald Wilson. He, I don't think this is going to mean that your ride is safe for 05, Wilson. He already, it was already announced that he's going to Whole Foods next year. <laughs> For Lenny Carson, who's coming full-time next year. I don't think this is going to help him because this is the most luck-based track I've ever seen in this in this series. Thompson is gaining like a second every lap, but it's not like it's going to do much. Oh my gosh, dude. I am this close to skipping. I just want this torture to end. Oh, Byron gets lapped. Uh, can you just come? Somebody else did this. Chris Frabel did this. He did this at Kansas. He was just, not Kansas, sorry, Texas. He just sat there, and I think he ended the race 41 laps down or something. It's not the first time I've seen someone just sit there and never leave. I don't know why. He literally looks like he has the best car, best looking car of anyone right now. A 10 second lead that can Wilson hold for tenths for six laps. I think he can. I am this close. This close to clicking the accelerator button, dude. This close. I know you can't see how close I am. This close, like I am clicking this drive button. The, the space in between this back and drive button is the is the amount of space I am this close to smacking the accelerate button to see who wins. Thompson's looking for a second win. Revler's looking for his first. Wilson's looking for his first. Byron's looking for his fifth. I mean, that's overall. Thompson won this year. Byron won twice last year and twice this year. Nope, there it goes. I think Wilson just won with that. Let me just, I have to do it. I can't skip. It skips too fast. I mean, Thompson was able to close in by two seconds, but unless Wilson, like, clips that right rear. Sorry, I sneezed. Um, unless Wilson clips that right rear in turn three into that wall, that's the only chance Thompson has of taking the victory. He has to clip that, that ending of the you know what I'm talking about. He has to clip that. Thompson can't. He need the flawless next two laps. And yeah, I don't think that's helping. Two laps until the end of this crap is done. Kelvin is 17, 18 laps down. He's not even going to pass Rutherford, and Rutherford's dead. Closing, but not enough, dude. Running out of time. Wilson just needs to kind of coast around now. This track should just be named Who Can Survive Till Turn 1? Who Can Survive the First Lap? Yeah, that should be it. Who Could Survive the First Lap? Survived. Thompson's running out of chances. He, needs, he has one more chance. One more. And he can't fall off, fluke on this turn. Didn't. Wilson, he Thompson has one chance for Wilson to mess up. White flag is out at the brickyard. The final time at this track. 
Donald Wilson out in front by eight seconds. As he comes off turn two, he comes off clean. Thompson nowhere to be seen. Seven and a half seconds back. Let's celebrate who got the fast slap. That is none other than Sergey Thompson himself. As he comes into turn three and four, Thompson's saving grace. That probably won't be happening. Wilson keeps it clean and will come off the final corner. Donald Wilson is going to get his first career win after bonking turn four. And will get his first career win in the Brickyard 400. Yay. Good for you, Donald. Good for you. Six second, we'll go to Thompson. He survived. He will finish. Six seconds. He was closing in so much. Reveler gets third. Byron fourth. And Bronze will get sixth because he couldn't get past the five. Thank God it's over. And Byron's point lead is actually not even funny. Yay. There's everyone else. No one lasts more than two laps, really. These guys didn't even last one. They all have zero. What the heck? And we go to standings. Byron now leads by 106. Oh my gosh, dude. It's over. It's over. Thompson just moved to third. What the heck? How did Drew... Oh my gosh. Smith died. Smith died. And Wilson moved to 42nd. Good. And there's Bo Derek Drew. So Derek Drew right now has a grand total of that. That added. So I don't think it's enough to pass Hermie, but it might actually be. He's actually pretty close. Anyway, I hope you guys like that video. Please like, please subscribe. I can't wait to see you in the next race. Bye.